What is going on? Luis is the first one in the chat. Hey, what's going on, dude? Everything tech. Number two. Fat boy pup. Hey, Liana. Same time, I guess, Luis. Ch Chassis ho. How's it going? I'm good, man. Or I guess your guy. Gabriel, what's going on? Andy. Hey, Carlo. Callie, lifestyle. Justin Kirk, what's up, Greg? Dave Noah. No, Noe. Dave Strokes. SB War Machine. Mike Will MD ordered from Samsung Mind was shipped. John, Charles, Dave, Tamaria, Danny, An Anus? <laughs> Anas? Um, before I get started, though, <clears throat> somebody from like the Netherlands texted me. I cannot text you back, so I'm sorry. If you want to be on the show, um, yeah, you'll have to. I don't know what we're going to do there. Just, I guess. Shoot me an email. I don't even know. Whoever you're from. Anyways, guys. How is everybody? We've got a huge show today. All about the Galaxy Note 8. The phone has shipped. Some people have tracking numbers. Some people have nothing going on at all with their tracking number. Some people are basically two days away from having this phone in their hands like this. Hello? And they're going to be on the phone and doing cool stuff with the S Pen and taking photos and doing all kinds of nice stuff. Also, if you got the LG V30. LG V30 looks amazing, guys. I did a video today. It looks like the phone might be as little as 750 freaking dollars. How awesome is that? Man. But yeah, let's get into it, guys. Let's get into some stories, some, some calls. Let's see what you guys have to say about what's going on. Whoa, Samir dropping a dime before I even drop on the call. Samir, if you want me to be if you want to be the first in the show, dude, shoot me a text real quick. 619-721-3699. That's for all of you. If anybody wants to be on the show, 619-721-3699. Super chat pushes you to the front of the line. That's that little dollar sign there where you're chatting. You click that, do a little don't know. Asian, and that will help me obviously and show your support for the show but also push you to the front of the line to be on the show so i'll give uh, samir a couple seconds here to text me 10 seconds if i don't get a text from him then i will go to he can be uh, uh on the show on the one of the next callers uh let's see all right samir okay i'm just gonna go into the first call here we go I think this person wants to be on. I'll call him. They texted me. He put the word live. So I'm assuming they want to be live, right? Let's see. Let's see if they even answer the freaking call. All right. Please leave your message for Whoa. six seven. Doesn't want to be on the show. Whatever. Call 210 next. Who is this? What are they? They said, did I miss the show? <laughs> you tell me. Oh, it's Morning Bear. Morning Bear is going to be all about this. He's going to have all kinds of iPhone questions. Hey, Grego. Hey, how's it going? Oh, I'm Morning Bear. I was thinking you were somebody else. I'm sorry. <laughs> Goodness. I'm you glad though. No, person. I know. I'm glad you're not the person I was thinking of. It is, <laughs> I'm fine. I'm glad it's you. <laughs> How are you? I'm good. <laughs> did you get the? Okay, did you? Did you? Did you pre-order the Galaxy Note Eight? Ah, uh, yes, I did. And who'd you pre? I got the black one. Who'd you pre-order it through? From Verizon. You ordered it through Verizon. So I'm assuming you get a tracking number, right? Yes, I did. And yes, I did. Is it? Is but it? I have a question for you. Before we get into that question, a, sorry, is it getting delivered uh, on Tuesday? No. Oh, okay, go. It's all yours. You're... Okay. My question would be, with the Note 8, I'm kind of feeling a little disappointed with it. It's not popping at me, you know? Yeah, I'm, I'm like with you. I'm missing from it. I'm, I mean, it's, it's tough to say there's some... I, I understand what you mean because there's... It's tough to say. Okay, there's miss something missing from it. But I mean, what what possibly could be missing from it? I agree with you. And in, in, but at the same time, it's not that big a change from the Galaxy S8 Plus. I think that's maybe what you mean more so. Am I right? Like you th you saw yeah. the S8 Plus and it's like, hey, this is kind of like an S8 Plus 
some more RAM. It's got uh, an S Pen um, and a slightly bigger screen. But other than that, not that much difference, right? Not too much of a difference. Yeah. No. I um, still. But yeah, what are you gonna say? You know what I was thinking. Um, Samsung was offering four hundred and twenty-five dollars for the Note Seven. I called them. So huh? I told them that my Note Seven yeah. is still active, hundred percent battery, internet, Wi-Fi, you name it. With that, four twenty-five, and then with Verizon, they sent me a check for three hundred and twenty-nine dollars for my other Note Seven. Okay. And I was wondering what all of that. Four, five, six, seven, that's already look close, a little over eight hundred bucks right there. Right. So how, so you think, so are you do. You, do you want to buy the phone outright, or? I thought I'd just go ahead and just buy it outright and yeah. not have a uh, no contract. That's what I normally do with my phones. Yeah. I don't like to be under any kind of contract. My suggestion is, if you're going to do that, is you might as well just buy the unlocked version, because the unlocked version will work on Verizon, um, and at the same time, you're not going to have any of the Verizon apps that you don't want, or any other apps that Verizon puts on there, or any skin. That Verizon changes on it, like isn't there gonna be, it's just going to be the regular experience from the phone manufacturer, and and in the long run, could actually end up being faster for you. Well, can you spread the, the word with your viewers that? Oh, by the way, it's been a long time since I had a chance to talk with you. So congratulations on your pregnancy. Oh, thank you. On the baby. <laughs> yeah. And um, Verizon was saying that with my Note Four. That they're offering two hundred and twenty-five to two hundred and fifty dollars if they re if people who have their Note Four or Note Five, <laughs> they can return it, get a two twenty-five to two fifty off. It's not that bad. But they're not offering anything off the Note Seven. Yeah, it's not. It, well, I saw you're saying Verizon's offering that, right? Yes. Yeah. Um, but Samsung's not offering any. Buddy, anything when it comes to the Note Four. Yeah, I know. It's, I said, well, uh, yeah. I mean, you could sell it on your own, but I, I, I haven't looked what the average price is for the the Note Four right now. Did you look online at all at Swappa or eBay? No, I have three of them. You have three Note so Fours. <laughs> yes, two oh black God. and a white one. So oh. I'm kind of upset. I just, you know, delete the one I don't like. It's well, Verizon right. is giving you a hell of a deal because I'm looking right now online and the Note Four. The highest price for any of them is the T-Mobile, well, is the unlocked version, and that's $199. So if you can get $250 or $200 from Verizon, I would definitely do it, especially if they're letting you trade in three at a time. That's a freaking amazing deal. That's really good. Yeah. Now, I'm going to keep two and just uh, turn in my white one. My white one was practically like brand new. Um, I kind of used up all the uh, memory, memories on those on the other two, so I kind of went with the white one just to start back over. But now, since I really don't use the white one that much, I can erase it, get two hundred bucks off, and thinking about getting the phone that way. Yeah, I'm just kind of. I want your help. You think it's really worth it? I the Note Eight. Yes. Yeah, I mean, if you're what, you're going from the which phone are you coming from? The Note Four. Well, I have the Note Four and the Note Seven. Well, what are you using right my now? My daily. You're called. You called me on my Note Seven. Okay, so if your Note Seven's working and you and you're and you're perfectly happy with it, then don't even upgrade. But because uh, I don't think the Note Eight this year is a huge. It is. A, it, it's a. It's definitely an upgrade from the Note Seven. But if you're not get like I would when I had the Note Seven, I was getting lag. And it was slow. It was slow for me. So that's what I would want. Why I would want to upgrade. But if you're not getting that, then just stick it out because the Note Eight I don't think offers that many new features for someone like coming from a Note Seven. And uh, you know, you still have a really good phone with a Note Seven. Uh, but yes, I do. <laughs> yeah. So then just 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 hold out, and then uh, like I said, if you can tr if if you can trade in all those. Those Note 4 phones right now to Verizon at the same time. And even if they just give you credit to their store in terms of like you can use it to pay your phone bill or you can use it in the future, then do that because that you're only going to lose value on those Note 4s anyway. They're charging the customers already. They're telling people to make sure that you have um, – well, I have to pay the tax. I have to pay – it was 100 – you know, to 108 
I yeah. believe it was. So right. they were saying that make sure you have that. But some say you sh- they shouldn't have charged you until it actually was able to be shipped out. Yeah. Well, that will. They already charged me for it. Let us let us know what you end up doing. It's uh, we're gonna have a busy show tonight, so I'm gonna jump on in the next call. But let us know what you end up doing. I'll be curious to see, and then you know. The, also keep your eyes on the LG V30 should be a great phone if you don't want to use that phone Pixel 2 XL or just stick with your Note 8 purchase and if you love it keep it awesome. if you don't return it awesome awesome I was afraid I missed your show because it's uh, seven fifteen here in Texas oh I'm yeah like, it's at 5 o'clock yeah I said I'm Pacific crazy. though yeah it's, it's tough for me oh. to say all the time zones yeah it's a little bit crazy so but uh, yeah I appreciate you calling in and uh, I hope you have an awesome day uh, you too, Gregos, and it was a pleasure speaking with you. Thank Keep you up so the much. Awesome work. All right, thank you so much. Okay, bye bye. Ciao. Morning Bear was the first call of the day. Let's get over to seven two four. Let's give them a call. Yeah. Whoa! What is this going on? Is this a rap song or a country song? I can't even tell. Hey. What's going on? No, I got a question with the note about the Note Eight. What is it? What's going on? Um, what can you do with the Note Eight versus the iPhone Eight? Like when it comes out, the S Pen. Get S Pen because I'm thinking about leaving T-Mobile for Verizon. Uh huh. Basically October. Okay. Because don't get me wrong, T-Mobile is a good company, but it doesn't work that great in my area. I, so. I, I don't think you're alone in that. I think a lot of people have issues with ri- reliability with with t-mobile um yeah i i you're gonna if have you ever had an android phone i have the android i have a zte right oh, now. okay yeah i mean that's gonna be the 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 note 8 should be a, a fairly big jump in uh every every uh quality and speed and and just overall feel in your hand versus that zte phone so I think you like I'll, it a lot because i'm used to i'm used to an iphone but i'm planning to go with the note this year I you? never had a note, and I want to try it. The yeah, note. you're going to like it, man. I, I really think you'll like it, for sure. Definitely. I think there's no doubt about that. Did you have any other questions? or? Yeah, but with the S Pen, you can, like, because I'm not sure they said you could, like, design your own art and something like that with it. Yeah, I mean, it has apps in there so you can draw and, and, and take notes and do art stuff and take screenshots and do, really, it's, it's it's almost unlimited what you can do with that pen. So if you really like to draw and, and take notes physically yeah. with a pen, you're going to love it, man. It's going to be definitely a phone you're going to like. Because I'm going to college and I need to take notes. So I think that Note 8 would be good for me. Yeah, for sure. For sure. Um, all right. I guess that's, I guess that's yeah. it. So uh, definitely call in again, and I appreciate your call. All right. Thank you. All right, later, bro. Whoa, Anthony's saying Greg's getting too big. I don't know if you call me fat <laughs> or I'm getting too big. I don't know if I'm getting too big. I, I mean, I am busy. I mean, it's tough to respond to everybody for sure, but uh, I don't think I'm getting too big. <laughs> There's a lot of people a lot bigger than me. If you guys want to be on the show, send me a text. The number's in the description. <clears throat> Calling 917. I don't think they're going to pick up. I'm going to hang up. One last call. One last ring. Rang, ring, ring. Ring, ring. All right. Hung up on that. Um, Yeah. What are you guys thinking? When's your. Does does anybody have um, ATT in here that ordered the Note 8? I should say, is anybody holding out and not buying the Note 8 because of whatever reason? I'd be curious about that. If you guys are holding out on the Note 8. 224, I'm calling you. 224. Hello? Uh, They hung up. 224, I called you. You didn't pick up. Man, you guys are doing bad. What app is used for the live show? I use YouTube. What do you mean what app is used? <laughs> Let's call 623. See if they pick up.
Yeah, you droid mania. I made a video when the AT and T customers have have gotten their um their tracking numbers. You've reached Ace Tactical Armament in Peoria. Dude, what is going on here? You guys are asking me to t call you, but then you don't pick up the freaking phone. Uh, hey, Netherlands guy. I don't know how we're going to do this. Um, I'd like to talk to you. I think it'd be cool. I don't have... Uh, shoot, dude. I have no idea how I'm going to call you. Because I can't call you on here. I don't have an app on my phone or my computer right now that I'm logged into that... I can have you call me. I want, like I said, I wouldn't mind calling you. 971, I'm calling you again. Dude, we're like batting 0 for freaking 4 right now with calls. So pick it up! 971. I think this is GTA, isn't it? Hey, Crackle. Hey, how's it going? Oh, it's uh, Liana. How are you? I'm good. What's going on? What's, what are you doing? I know I can't wait for the note to come up, but I'm planning to get it on December. You, so you're going to get the note. You, you you want the note, eight, but you haven't pre-ordered it yet, and you want to get it in December? Yeah, I'm going to wait for the down payment to lower down a little bit, because for T-Mobile, you have to pay $210. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I saw that. It's kind of lame. I don't know why they're doing yeah. that. Yeah, so I'm just going to round to December until... The price lowers down a little bit, so... You probably won't even have to wait till December. I bet you'll have to wait one month before it gets rid of that $210 restriction. Yeah, so... Yeah, I'm looking forward to that because it has new features, I know that, and it has a better camera than the iPhone. Yeah. Yeah, for sure and, it does, yeah. Yeah, and the other thing is I'm still uh, feeling from my wisdom teeth. Your wisdom teeth. You got your wisdom teeth pulled, and yeah. you. Would you say you're trying to recover from that, or what? You need to pay that I'm off. I'm from that because they took it out on Thursday. Okay. Well, I hope you feel better. Yeah, but sometimes, sometimes I feel pain a little bit still. Oh, that's not good. Well, that's nothing that that pain is nothing that a Note 8 couldn't fix for you. So once you get that Note 8, it's going to alleviate that pain in your mouth. Yeah, and I wonder, <laughs> I wonder, if, do you know if there's going to be other colors by the time I get the Note 8 on December? Do I, is there going to be what? Is there any other colors going to be available for the Note 8? Oh, colors. I think it said colors. Uh, colors, um, not probably by December. I I would think if they do any colors, it would probably be early next year. I don't think they'll uh, do. I don't think they'll do colors this year. I think it'd be next year. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Cause I just wanted to find out. Oh my gosh, that deep sea, that deep sea blue color is really nice. That's nice, huh? I know a lot of people like that. Yeah, a lot of people like that. It's a nice color. It would look so I good. Mean, it would look so good next to next to your face. Imagine that blue blue phone catching the oh, sun yeah. a little bit. The guys waving at you. Oh yeah, see. So awesome. Yeah. They love it. They'd love it. Liana, do you got anything else? No, that's it. But I'm looking forward to getting the the the. No day, cause that's what I really want. Cause they have new features and, like what you say, you can draw, and. Yeah. Well, Liana, yeah. where everyone in the chat room is gonna pray for you, not only for your pain to go away in your mouth, but also, for you to get your no date as fast as possible. Oh yes, I'm going back to Android. Cause the thing I miss about Android is the swipe text. Yeah. Well, you got that. No iPhone has that. I know, but I would rather use it in Android. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Well, all right. Well, I'm oh. well, I'm glad you're coming back and uh, keep us up to date with your Note Eight situation. Okay. Take care. Take care, care Gregos. And all right. have a nice day. All right. I'm sending out a virtual hug to you. Thanks. Peace out. Bye. <laughs> Leanne is a funny gal. All right. What are you saying? Hi, Greg. Love your show. Keep up the good work. Thanks, LaTanya. LaTanya? 
Get some more females on here. If you if you want to be on the show, guys, shoot me a text, 619-721-3699. I want to hear your opinions on the Galaxy Note 8 shipping situation, the Galaxy Note 8 phone, and the LG V30. I'm open to talk about that. FFDP fan. What is that? It must be a heating and air conditioning thing, I'm guessing. Let's see. I'm curious. Hello? Hey, what's going on? It's Greggles on Greggles TV hey, Live. What's up? Hey, what's your first name again? Hey, Greggles, what's going on? What was your first name again? Adam. Adam. What's going on, dude? My How are you? Adam, yeah. How's what's it up? going? I'm good, good man. What's, what's, uh, what's going on in your mind? Oh, not much. I just wish that the U.S. would have more color options than, you know, only two. But Yeah. And that gold is, I don't know, that gold is kind of ugly. It is, yeah. <laughs> But I mean, so what? What I mean, the the good part of it, I guess, or bad part, is that regardless of which colored phone you get, they're all the same color on the on the front. They're all black. Yeah, that that's that's a good thing. I, I'm glad <laughs> they did that. I, I went with uh, I went with two two uh, black Note eights. Okay. But what I did was at first is because I have the S7 Edge right now because. I initially got the S8 Plus. Yep. And then uh, I was like, I had it for a little bit, and then I was like, well, I was like, it's like, well, the Note 8 just around the corner. I was like, maybe I should just wait a little bit. I was like, is it really necessary to upgrade us? So I was like, so what I did is I got a hold of Sprint, and I was like, you know, I'm going to return it and I'm going to wait. So, and I'm actually kind of glad I did that, you know, because I just. I, I missed the S Pen, you know. Yeah, yeah, no, I think a lot of people do. Um, I'm not in that boat. I don't miss it because I don't use it a lot, but it, it's a cool thing to have because um, it can do some cool tricks. Right. But uh, yeah, yeah I'm, it, to me, it, it's not a huge deal. But uh, what, what do you think about? Yeah, have you seen the? Just to kind of kind of uh, plays devil's advocate here. Have you seen the LG V30 at all? Any videos on it? Yeah, I've, I've I've seen a lot of videos about the the LG V30. Yeah. Now, what do you think like, about? I actually, I I've, I watch I watch YouTube you know videos you know quite a bit. I actually watch yours a lot. I, you. I watch <laughs> I watch a lot of YouTube videos uh, quite a bit. I actually uh, been a subscri- subscriber for yours uh, probably for like maybe like the last uh, maybe six months now. Okay. Um, you know, so I'm. I make sure I keep up on your videos, you know, with the cases and, you know, the the reviews and, you know, things like that. So Thanks, man. But, yeah, with the LG V30, yeah, oh, yeah, no problem. Uh, but, yeah, the LG V30, that looks like a pretty awesome phone, too. I mean, I haven't had, you know, the, the chance to, you know, quite think about that yet. The V20 was, you know, I played around with the, my friend's V20 for a little bit, and I was like, ah, I was like, like ah, I'm not really feeling the V20. Yeah, no, I didn't the V30, either. V30. I mean, I'll, I'll, you know, I'll play around with the V20, uh, the V30 for a little bit. Yeah. Um, after I, you know, get the Note 8 and everything, but. Um, so what? What's I, I just b- besides the S Pen on the uh, to kind of put it back on the Note 8, finish this up. Uh, besides the S Pen on the Note 8, is there anything about the Note 8 you're really excited about, or maybe even disappointed about? I don't know. I I just love. I don't know. I've always been like a note, a note fanatic. I guess yeah. I've, I've had like every single, I've had every note device that came out. Yep. You know, when it first initially, you know, came out, you know, I was like, I was ecstatic when it first came out. I was like, oh my god, this is so, <laughs> this is so sweet. You know, you know, I was just showing it off to everybody, and I was like, oh, look what this can do. I was like, you know, so I don't know. I guess it's just been, you know, more of a, you know. Yeah, I hear you. I don't want to say a habit. I guess I don't want to say more of a habit. I guess, but um, I just got so used to, you know, having, you know, that that feature, that feature set. Yeah. You know, you right, know, it's right. nice to have that. You know, to be able to take the S Pen out and just, you know, jot down a note, you know, whenever you need to, you know, just in case, you know, you don't have to, you know, you know, you don't have to actually look for a pen anywhere. You know, you got one right in your phone. Right. Cool, man. Well, I'm glad yeah, you're excited but, about the phone. And who'd you order then, it from? Uh, uh, mine's from mine's from Sprint. Oh, and okay. The, and the funny thing is, is because um, 
I actually got a notification from Sprint saying that mine actually shipped on the 30th, yep. and it was ready for UPS, you know? I yeah, mean, yeah. there was no tracking information or anything like that right away. Right. You know, so I was like, oh, maybe I'll get it on the 1st, you know? But then, obviously, you know, when the 1st came around, then that's when I got my tracking information, and then it said it was redirected and, you know, scheduled for the 5th. So awesome. I'm scheduled to get mine on the 5th, you know, just like you know everybody else for sprint i think so. yeah that's awesome man i'm happy to hear for you from you about that because sprint verizon and getting it looks like right on the fifth a lot of you guys so congrats and uh definitely let us know what you think about the phone if you want to send some photos or videos over to be included in a video that i make definitely send that over if you feel like but otherwise definitely enjoy your phone oh yeah for sure i'll, I'll definitely you know send you some pictures when i when I get the Note 8 in hand, and I'll, I'll let you know what I think for sure. All right, man. I appreciate it. Have an awesome night. All right. All right. Later, All right. brother. Keep up the good work, man. Thanks, dude. Appreciate your videos. Thank you so much. All right. Later. Someone was asking me, I didn't catch the name, asked me which camera I use to record my videos. Like, not these videos, but my actual videos. I use the Panasonic GH4. Awesome camera. Some focus issues sometimes, but otherwise a really, really nice looking camera. Um, if you guys want to be on the show, if I called you and you missed the call, just text me again. It'll put you back in line. Otherwise, I can't be looking for your names and stuff. Just text again, 619-721-3699, and I'll put you on the show. <coughs> you got it? Good. 718 is next. Even though they texted me from a completely different number. Let's see if they actually answer this. What's up, Grid? Just sending you a text, hoping you receive my email. So today's Sunday. Hello. Hey, you're live with Greggles TV. Who is this? Yeah, this is Paul. How you doing, guys? Paul, where are you calling from? Um, I'm a uh, Brooklyn guy. Let me load a little volume on my phone because I got you over here. Oh, okay. Camera. All right. Yeah. How you doing, guys? Good, man. What's on your mind tonight? Uh, no, nothing about the uh, the note the note eight. I mean, everybody seems to like try to match it up with the uh, the S eight plus, but Think about this. What if the uh, the SA Plus didn't come out and the Note came out first? That's, what would they say? That's a and great And then the S Plus, point. right? They would say, yeah. oh, the S8 uh, Plus was copied from the Note 8. Yeah. You know? Yeah, that's a great point. But I think, yeah, but I think the phone is, uh, to me, I'm waiting for it because I had the 7. You know, I had the, the 3, the 4, the 5. I still have the 5. Yeah. And I had three of the 7s, and I had to turn them in, you know, because recall in Brooklyn, you know, with the fire and all that yep so now i'm really anxious you know i got i just got another i think i sent you uh you know the notice on the third it said right so you know like since i'm on sprint i've been with sprint for a long time right close to 18 years on their service so uh -huh. yeah I'm getting it uh, t uh tuesday yeah you're gonna get so, it on the fifth dude that's super exciting I'm, i wish mine was coming on the fifth um but it's not <laughs> i ordered it from best buy but um yeah that you're lucky to do that because it's going to be jumping from even the Note 7 to the Note 8, it's uh, to me, it's not a right. huge jump. It's definitely a physical jump because it, the phone does look mm -hmm. slightly different. And you're losing the, the yeah. home button. You're getting skinnier and taller. Um, so you are getting some differences with that. But, uh, yeah, you're right. If when you, To go back to your original thought, you know, if the Note 8 had come out before the had Galaxy S8. First, right, yeah, right. people, and I agree. Say. But the point is, the, the, the issue is, is that it, that did not happen. So that's why people are having some issue with this. Yeah, My yeah. idea to fix this, and I've said this in previous videos, is that they released the Galaxy S series in the very beginning of the year. That way, yeah. that phone yeah. has a slightly different processor, you know, just slightly different everything. That way, and plus it gives them more time to hash out the note. So that's the big issue, and I think we're gonna keep running into this issue, because it costs a yeah. lot of money to, to create a completely different phone day year in and year out, so. Well, my wife's got the, she just, you know, I just got her the S8 Plus. It, it, I'm telling you, it's a great phone. It is. It's a great phone. Yeah. I mean, it's, it's amazing. You know, she's not really a techie like me. You know, I know all the yeah. specs and how to set it up. But, you know, for me, I always like the Note. No matter what it has or doesn't have, the Note to me is like, you know, the high, the highest level of, of phones. And yeah. I mean, for me, it is. You know. For sure. And people are turning and criticizing, oh, because it, it looks like... Yeah, man, but it's it's you know it's they're trying to replace the Note Seven and yeah. this phone. It, it looks great. I mean, I can't wait to get my hands on it. So let's we'll see what happens anyway. Yeah, I'm excited for the rest of the year. I say it all the time. The Galaxy yeah, so, Note Eight, the LG V30, yeah. the Pixel phone. The, I'm so excited. Yeah, I was excited. 
I was excited for the essential phone. Now I'm not so excited, especially when I've well, seen. You know why? It's, it, this phone is just coming out, so he's getting the basics. I'd yeah. say within about another three or four years, it'll, it'll, up, it'll up it again. You know, yeah, it's like it every other company. They start with, with a small phone, yep. and then they start working themselves up to you know something better. Right. Exactly. You know. It's so, like the plus, uh, the the one plus. Now yep. they have different versions, so you know exactly. it's going to take time. Did you have time. Did you have anything else you wanted to talk about? Uh, no, it was just a note. You know, hopefully, uh, you know, everybody's going to be happy when the when they when they get their hands on the phone. But once I get it, I'll send you a couple of pictures. So you yeah, know, for you know, sure, man. I appreciate that. Let me know what you all think right, about great. it too. I'll accumulate all your guys' thoughts and and feelings about the yeah, phone. Yeah. I'd be curious to know what everyone thinks about it. All right, absolutely. All right, Thanks man. For the call, too. Good luck with the phone, and I hope you enjoy yeah. it. Yeah, we'll keep in contact. All right, yeah, brother. We'll, 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 all right, you take care. Thank you. All right, back. Okay. All right. I should have asked that guy for a little New York sli- style slice. I love New York pizza. Um, yeah. Oh, what is it going to say? If you guys want to uh, support the show, check out those links down below. Um, I try to do this. I'm trying to do this full time. I'm not quite there. Uh, so if you want to support the show and join Patreon, there's a link down below. Click on that Patreon and sign up. I would be greatly appreciative of that. If you can't do that, then also check out. There's a link down there to do T-shirts. If you want a Greggles TV T-shirt, it's shipped through Amazon, ordered through Amazon. Who doesn't have an Amazon account? Check that link down below and do some swag, swag, swag. Check out that. All sizes too, from small all the way up to like, I think like 3 or 4XL, so huge sizes. Um, and then also, if you don't even want to do that, you also have that little dollar sign. Click that dollar sign right where you're chatting. That is going to not only push you to the front of the line if you want to call into the show, but also to show you support for the show. So thank you guys so much. Even for the people that are just hanging out in the chat, thank you so much. I appreciate it. This is one of the biggest live shows I've ever done so far, and uh, it's definitely quite exciting. 323 is next. I think his name is Roy. <clears throat> this is Roy, tat to boy. All right. Roy, Roy, Roy. <coughs> Roy Richards. Hey, hey. Roy, how are you? What's going on, Greg? How you been, man? I'm good, man. Where's 323? Uh, I'm actually in Los Angeles, but uh, directly in the city of Bell. Okay. Did I talk to you before? Yes, you have. Okay. You, are you the guy that went to Vegas? And I just got back. <laughs> how was the so? Before we get into the real stuff, how was the how was that weekend? Because you went there during the fight, the 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 McGregor Mayweather, right? Right. Okay. So how was that? Um, how did the whole weekend? How was that weekend for you? Surprisingly, uh, the the road trip up there. Yeah. Normally it takes about five hours, depending on traffic. It only took about four hours. There was no traffic. That is weird. No traffic. Uh, when I got down there, like. I actually have a Periscope, so some of my friends were um, viewing it through Periscope, and so I was able to watch it as my friends were driving because I'm, you know, safe like that. Yeah, yeah. But, yeah, so I got, you know, the best of both worlds. And when I got down there, it was, uh, the the fight had already finished, so the streets started to get a bit crowded, but, you know, I was just in time for me to get to my, my <coughs> hotel and avoid all the traffic, so I was good. That's awesome, man. Well, cool. I'm glad you had had a easy easy time getting there. So, what's on your mind tonight? Is the Galaxy Note eight the, L- the LGV thirty? What is it? Oh, the Note eight. Okay, absolutely. Where'd you order it from? Um, so, uh, T-Mobile. Okay, and you so you probably have a tracking number, but no tracking, right? Right. Okay. And of course, like going through UPS and it shows, hey, yeah, it shipped, and you know that's it. Dot dot dot. Yep. And I'm, I mean, I'm, it, it'll be here eventually. So, you know, <laughs> me not getting it on the 5th, if it doesn't come on the 5th, you know, it's not like the phone that I have is not going to work. So yeah, it's like, I'll enjoy it once I get it. You know, same as everyone else should <laughs> be doing. <laughs> For sure. Yeah, you'll probably have but, it. I mean, you might even have it this week. I wouldn't be surprised by that, especially since Sprint and Verizon customers are supposed to get it on the 5th. I really won't be surprised if you guys get it either the middle of the week or the end of the week. Right. So, yeah, and when I get it, I'm going to do like I always do. I'm going to use the pen until I get carpal tunnel and then put it <laughs> away for a while. And when I remember, pull it back out and, you know, and play with it. So, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, let me ask you really quick. Yeah. Now, the week that, the week, last weekend when I was going to Vegas, you were coming to LA and I did see your video. Yeah. 
is that all you did or did you kind of like see the fight here in LA? No, I just went up there and went, and went back. So we, we drove up right after our nine to five job. We got there fairly a little bit before we had to head over to the event. So we stopped by, got uh-huh. some lunch and then we uh, went right over to that event. After the event, we literally went right home. Um, uh, so yeah, I didn't hang around LA too much. I like LA. I, I like it more and more every time I go back, but it's still a little bit too busy for me. But it's the the, the women are beautiful. <laughs> the women are beautiful up there. So the sexy women and oh, uh, yeah. and uh, it, it's it's cool. It's 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 pretty. It's a good looking town. Like we were in West Hollywood, and you can see the mountains in the background, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah. And uh, it's just it's a good looking town at, at points of it. Some of it's ugly, but it's just like any city. So, but yeah, I, I, we had a good time. So it was and to talk about the 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 essential phone a little bit I wasn't it. Was, I was impressed by the the look of it and the feel of it in my hand. But in terms of uh-huh. what I see now with the LG V30, and obviously I already knew about the Note 8. It doesn't really yeah. stand up to those phones so much. But it's definitely if the phone was cheaper, I would probably be more excited about it. But at seven hundred dollars, especially when the LG V30 is supposed to be seven hundred and fifty dollars, th- there's no right. there's no competition. You would go LG V30 all day. It just offers more for the more bang for the buck. So, but yeah, I had a good time though. Nice. Yeah. Now the LG V30, I really am considering getting that one for my mom. Hmm. Um, just because of the the size and she's. She knows how to use a phone, but like, of course, she she thinks that she can just grab the Note Eight and utilize it uh-huh. when all she really does is pick up the phone, make a phone call, send a text, and that's it. Yeah. So I told her that's a really expensive, literally <laughs> just a phone. <laughs> you need to get something that's going to suit you. Yeah. Because she sees me using it, and she sees the things that I'm doing with it. And I said, "You don't do this. <laughs> you." <laughs> You make a phone call, you send a text, and yeah. you put the phone down and let it charge the capacity and then pick it up again. So, yeah. <laughs> That's funny. It's funny you say that because I that happens. It's really easy to wow an, an older person, especially like I'm assuming your mom's in her 60s or 70s. Like my mom's in her 60s and 70s. Yeah. Like People in that age range are really easy to impress. But then when they actually have the device, they don't do anything with it. So it, right. you're right. Like I, my mom has an iPhone 7 Plus. But she doesn't do anything with it. Not that you can do tons of stuff with it, but she doesn't even. I, I, I try to call her in video chat and she doesn't know that you have to flick up, you know, with the green button to answer. Like she can't figure that out. And it's like, what the. Well, I should just get you a, a dumb phone. But at that point, I mean, the, this iPhone 7 Plus is. But for her, is going to last her for years. Probably like three years, yeah. four years, which is fine with Absolutely. me because it's a good phone. It has water resistance. And uh, so if she drops it in the toilet or brings it in the pool by accident. She'll be safe, right? So, I mean, that's the that's what that's what I like about it. But yeah, you're right. It's it's really easy to wild them, but they don't use it for anything else, <laughs> right? And that's why I try to make sure that I convince her to get something more in in the the range of what her needs are versus what is popular. Yeah, for sure. So, um, all right, cool. Did you have anything else you wanted to talk about, or? Uh, no, actually, I'll I'll as everyone else is doing, I'll send you a text and. A little, a quick little video when I get it and do my little pseudo uh, grand opening of of my Note Eight, as I've done with all the other ones. But it's all of my other ones are on Facebook. Okay, yeah, cool. I might even know. Sure. I mean, just just thinking real quick right now, I might even do. I might set up like Skype or something or some kind of video chat on my thing so that you know we can do another not just you but anybody we could do like a live video chat and you guys can talk about your phone and show it off if you wanted to. On yeah, the live hey, show you should try Zoom. That one seems to work pretty good. Which on the, but is it on the computer? Uh, it can be, yeah. What is it? Zoom? Zoom, Z O O M. Okay, I'll check M-S-M-Mary. it out. Amazon Mary, yeah. I'll check it out. Cool, man. All right, Roy, I appreciate the call. Always a good always good talking to you. Yeah, you too, man. Have All a right, great man. one. Have a good one. Thanks. Thanks. <clears throat> Mr. Roy, Roy is always a good call. Um I think you guys are asking me a question. Let me see if I'm, I know someone asked me a question. Tamara, you need to feed these questions to me. I don't, I'm don't. i missing them on. You're, you talk to everybody. Come on, Tamaria. He said, what case have you seen in what group? Edgar, about the cases for the Galaxy Note 8, I honestly, I mean, they're all okay. I don't. There's no cases I'm like in love with. So I don't really have a full-on opinion for that. 
I'd like to do a full review with them, uh, with the phones, to, in order to give you guys that opinion. But right now, I don't really have a full-on opinion for it, so I'll hold off judgment. <clears throat> Let's call 201 next. 201 from New Jersey. All right, got that. And then 402, you're next, but 201 is first. My wife should have her Note 8 on Tuesday. That's what it says on her profile. Cool. What's up, Cherie? Please leave your message for 20182. Cherie, you want to be on the show? Cherie, shoot me a text. I like I like talking to the, the females on here. The guys are cool, too, but we don't get enough females on the show. And I know I got my female fans because you follow me on social media. And I see your faces or, uh, uh, you know, you, I see your names in the comments. 402 is next. Gonna answer. Man, is someone just pranking me with all these damn numbers? <laughs> What's up, I'm sick sorry, Eric? The person you were What's up? Four one four is next. The guy from the Netherlands, I don't have a number you can call. Just get a Google, download Google Voice, Netherlands guy. Hello? Hey, what's going on, 414? Hey, what's up? Who's this? My name's Brad. Brad, how, where are you calling from? Uh, Milwaukee. Milwaukee. What's going on? How's, uh, how's Milwaukee? I, I don't know. There's not much going on. I'm just anxious. To get my phone in the mail, but I haven't really heard anything <coughs> since I pre-ordered it. Where'd you so, pre-order it from? Uh, directly off Samsung website on day one. Did you get the unlocked version or a carrier version? I got the unlocked version. Okay. What color? Uh, uh, midnight black. Midnight black. Same as me. Same, I, but I got mine from Best Buy unlocked. So what uh, would you want to say about it? What do you want to talk about it? Well... I just think it's kind of odd that since I got it on pre-order day one, it says on your shows that everybody's getting tracking numbers and stuff, and mine still says pre-order when I go and look at it. Yeah. I haven't heard anything about it. What do, well, it's going in first come first uh, order for, the, for, for everybody, especially for Samsung, though, I've read. So when did you order your phone? I ordered it on the 24th of August. So that was the first day, right? No, no, the 23rd was. Oh, wait, what day was Actually, I'm looking in September. Let me see. Oh, it's October. So it's October. so they announced it on the... Yeah, that was the first day you could pre-order it, right? I'm drawing, I think. I'm yeah. Sure. Yeah. Did you do it like right at, what was it, midnight or whatever? Um, it was about 12.31 o'clock in the morning. Okay. Yeah, so if you did it that early, then you should definitely be getting a, uh, a something in the. You should be getting an email very soon about that, because th you're you should be one of the first people to pre-order it, especially from Samsung. So I, I would think that you're going to get an email this week about getting it, at least because I like I said, people are starting to get their 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 pre-order uh, pre-ordered tracking numbers for that. So I would assume you're going to get it soon. All right, what's your take on screen protectors for it? Because I got the OtterBox case for it, and yep. I'm still a little worried about pocket dust because uh, fine scratches on the screen just annoy me. Yeah, I, I, honestly, if I had to guess, I, I have one right now, but obviously I don't know how good it is because... I don't have the phone yet, but if I had to guess, I would think they're going to suck. They're, the, the phone is curved a little bit, so I'm assuming it's not going to be that great. And if you think about a glass, especially tempered glass, when you it's gonna, it's just not going to be that great. It's going to slip. It's going to come off with the case. It's going to be crappy, most likely. It's not the, the the days of really good tempered glass. I think are are beyond us. I think at this point, unless they start going back to flat screens, 
I, I don't think we're ever going to see really, really good tempered glass solutions again. I mean, some people will talk about this one's good or that one's good, but if you look at the reviews, they're generally really bad, especially on Amazon. So I don't think we're ever going to see good tempered glass again. But so if at that point, definitely I'll have one so you can watch that review once I get, get it on there. But keep your eyes peeled on Amazon for different reviews to see what people say. Um, Obviously, if you get one and it sucks, make sure if you, wherever you buy it, you can return it so you can get your money back. But uh, otherwise, just get a nice case. Get a case that's going to protect you. Get a UAG case. Uh, those cases are usually highly protective and uh, not they're expensive, but they're you know in the forty dollar range, so they're not crazy. Um, just get a good case to be just to be safe and be careful with the phone, you know. All right, sounds good. Cool, man. If uh, thanks for calling, I appreciate the call. Uh, yeah. right. Later, Continue watching the stream. Keep yeah. up the good work. Thank you, man. I appreciate it. All right. Milwaukee. I think it's my first call from Milwaukee. I'm digging. I want to go to Milwaukee. Milwaukee looks like a cool place, actually. Looks really nice there. And it's just funny because I don't think a lot of people go to Milwaukee for vacation, especially from the, the West Coast. <coughs> Mark, you're next. 734, unless you're not Mark. You have reached the voicemail box of seven three. Whoa, Morning Bear saying I still haven't. I mean, she's having Note Eight buyer remorse. My Note Seven is still working. Morning Bear, they cancel that thing. If you don't, if you guys don't want it, you know, definitely cancel or return it when you get it. You know, get your money back. Hey, uh, everything, everything Android. I'm calling you next. Josh, Josh. Josh is from Palm Springs. I'm gonna have to write little biographies on you guys because I forget sometimes. I know I've talked to you, but sometimes it takes a few trigger words words to get my mind yeah, hello? rolling. Hey Josh, how's it going? Yo, what's up, Gregor? What's going oh, on, man? Not much, man. What's new? Not much, not much. So, what's uh, on your mind? Uh no, no I'm I'm getting uh, I'm actually getting hooked up with the Note 8 by my buddy. He's a uh, pretty high end up there in uh T Mobile. Uh -huh. And he's gonna he worked out some sponsoring with a device, so I got that coming uh, pretty soon here. So I can't wait for that. So do you end up? But, um, do you end up getting that phone for free from him, or like at a really good price? Or no, yeah, I got it for free. He he hooked wow. it up pretty good. So. That's awesome. Yeah, because he knew about my channel and stuff. He's like, hey man, I'll help you out, hook you up. So hey, that, that so that was pretty cool. That's awesome. Congrats, but, man. Um, yeah. So, but I, I currently right now I do have the S8 Plus, and because um, I wasn't. You know, I, I like the Note 8. You know, it's a nice phone. There's no doubt about that. It, you know, it's a beautiful device. But yeah. uh, my opinion, someone coming from an S8 Plus, it wouldn't be that much of an upgrade. I mean, the, the two noticeable differences to me are, you know, obviously you get the bigger screen and then the dual camera. Oh, and then obviously the S Pen as well. Right. But, I mean, I think if you're not a huge fan of the S Pen, then it wouldn't really be worth it. To, I mean, if you're coming from the S8 Plus, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. What, uh, so are you going to get your phone the same time as everyone else, or do you have to wait a little bit longer? Well, it says it says that it's shipped already, so okay, I don't awesome. know if it's, I, 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 I'm, it, it doesn't have a specific date. Yeah. And um, I, I put in the tracking number, and it won't, uh, it doesn't really show me anything. It just says ship. Yeah, I, that's, so a, that's what's happening to Hopefully this week. That's what happened to everybody with the T-Mobile stuff. Yeah, they have tracking numbers. Not everybody, but almost everybody has tracking numbers and with no tracking information yet, unfortunately. Yeah, yeah. Um, so hopefully, hopefully this week. I mean, it's a ship, so I mean, we'll see. Which but, phone um, do you have now, Josh? I have the SA Plus right now. Okay, I see. So obviously, you know, it's a quote unquote won't be a huge jump, most likely. Uh, from what everyone yeah. that has both phones has said, uh, and what f just on the surface you can see, but what what's some is there anything about the Note Eight you're looking forward to besides getting it for free? <laughs> <laughs> um, I, I really want to trust the camera because the thing is, um, I have two channels, you know, and I don't have like a, uh, I don't really have a camera. I use my smartphone to record everything. Yeah. So a, a camera for me is a big deal. I use right now, you know, I have my SA Plus. So I'm really curious to see just how well that camera performs but i also was looking at the lg v30 i watched a lot of reviews and i'm i'm really liking you know what i see so far about that camera uh -huh. so for my sa plus 
you know, like I said, I wasn't going to upgrade to the Note 8, but this Algae V30 might be worth it for me. I'm still thinking about it. It does look very attractive, though. But Yeah, um, it does. I'm, I'm, I'm actually, it's funny because... I'm very excited. That's probably the phone in, until the Pixel maybe comes out. But the LG V30, I'm most excited about that phone right now. Even with the Note 8 coming out, I'm still probably most excited about the V30. I mean, I am excited to get my hands on the on the 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 Note just to see if it does gets rid of the lag situation. And if it does, that phone for me yeah. will be a, <laughs> a total winner. Uh, but if it doesn't, then yeah. it's it's going. I'm going to give it up again for sure. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I can't wait for the LG V30. I mean, I did go to my. Uh which I, I've seen that you did as well um, at the local Best Buy store. Got to yep. mess with the Note 8 there for a while. Yeah, yeah. And, um, yeah, and I kind of compared it, you know, with my S8 Plus, and, you know, they're very, very similar. I mean, unless you're you're someone coming from, like, you know, a lower-end device, and, heck, yeah, if you got the money to spend and get it, you know what I mean? You're not going to be disappointed, but... Exactly. I mean, like I said, for myself, I don't think I'm going to be... I mean, I'm already getting it, but if I wasn't getting it, I, I don't think I'd be upgrading to the... The Note 8 for my SA Plus, to be honest. Yeah, I, I I would have a tough time doing it too if I wasn't, you know, making videos about tech. I, I probably would be the same as you. I probably wouldn't do it. But cool, Josh. Yeah. I appreciate the call, dude. Definitely, you're a lucky man getting that phone for free, and uh, I hope you enjoy it. And <laughs> yeah, I can't wait. Uh, good luck with the channel, man. All right, thanks. Appreciate All right, it, man. L- later, you, you later, bro. What you're doing? Thank you. Have a good one. All right, later. Josh, 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 Josh. Two two five. You are next. Whoa, 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 whoa
I really don't want to go backwards, you know, and I wanted to stick with Samsung, but it was just wasn't nothing out right at that time. Other than the S7, I mean, it wasn't that old, but I just felt like, you know, no, nah, I'm just going to get with something new right now. And I mean, I, I, people people bash it a lot, you know, they'll do the, it didn't, it wasn't a good phone. And I mean, it's not a, it's not a, a terrible phone. Yeah. You know, uh, but I is mean, there, the HDAG would works good, but <laughs> I mean, are you uh, impressed with all? That, are you impressed with the LG V30 at all? Oh yeah, yeah, definitely. Um, you know, um, with with I mean, I think what LG had the already the the dual lens already right before anybody else. Was, yeah, right. Is that right? Yeah. So I mean, um, but yeah, I mean. Uh, it's gonna be it's gonna be up there with with you know everybody else with Samsung and and Apple and well we'll see we'll see how that goes. Yeah, it'll be it, it'll you, be. Are you are you getting that? Did you already order the the V V thirty? Well, you can't order the V thirty just yet. Um, you have to wait. It, it's there. It they just announced it, but they haven't announced when it's gonna be released or the price. I mean, we just have rumors right now, so. I haven't yet, but I do plan on it, um, and I'm and it, it should be a, a cool phone. So yeah, I haven't yet, but I'm definitely looking forward to it. Uh, that's cool. That's cool. Yeah, yeah. Uh, cool, anything man. else? No, man. That's that's pretty much it. And uh, I was waiting for you to say something on the on the. I guess mine's really behind, and I was like, oh wait a minute, my phone's ringing from six one nine. Dude, okay. oh my god, I know, no. I know, I have like I. I seriously have like 20 calls. Even I, I don't even know if I'm going to be able to reach everybody. It's like I'll be making calls till like midnight. <laughs> it's a good problem to have, though, for sure. So, yeah, man, thanks for yeah. calling in, dude. No, no problem. Thanks for having me, man. All right, later, Appreciate brother. It. Be safe. Later. All right. Man, I know. I have like so many freaking calls. It's very cool. <laughs> I just don't know if I can. I'd have to make keep everybody under a minute, which I know it's impossible because I know a lot of you guys want to. Share your opinions and thoughts, and I, I think that's cool. It's just tough to do all the calls. <laughs> Let's see who's this. This is Keith. Keith is next. Hello? Hey, what's going on, Keith? It's Greggles. Uh, Greg, you're on live. Hey, what's up, Greggles? Good, man. What are you, what's going on? What's new? Not much, man. The snow day is uh, is driving me crazy, man. Well, what, what's, why is it driving you crazy? <clears throat> All right, so I work for Verizon. Okay. And what's crazy about it is I told my account manager that my Note 8 is coming. He's yeah. like, dude, you can't activate it. I'm like, why not? I'm like, Verizon is probably not going to allow us to activate these when they come. <laughs> I'm like, that's crazy. I'm like, why? <laughs> They said probably because the I and the I is gonna probably be locked. And we probably won't be able to activate them until the 15th. Yeah. Which I'm kind of curious of what's gonna happen on Tuesday. I don't think you guys are gonna block it. I think you guys are gonna allow it. I mean, if you don't, oh my God, it's gonna be such bad uh, karma for, not karma, but publicity for you guys. <laughs> you have yeah. to, you know? You have to. But another thing, that was kind of like talking to all my refs about is that the iPhone is going to probably be announced probably next week. Yeah. So Samsung is kind of scared of the iPhone and wants to be like, you know what, let's get these phones out because that's going to help us prevent any kind of return exchanges or cancel on orders so people will go to the iPhone. Yeah. Yeah, it's... um. Man, it's a, you guys are in for, definitely for a predicament if you guys hold back on that. But I think you guys will allow it for sure. I don't think it'll turn into anything bad. Because, I mean, it, it, if Sprint's going to do it and you guys don't, or, and, or it just causes an issue, it's going to be big-time problems for you guys. Yep. You know? but, as a, as, but as a customer, I do got to say that I'm excited about the phone. I've been doing my tracking. When I saw the tracking number hit my inbox. Yep. I called my buddy in California. I'm like, dude, we're getting our phones. He's like, what? Get out of here. And uh, my tracking is at, and I, I'm from New York, and I moved to Atlanta. Um, my phone is actually in Atlanta right now. 
and it's supposed to be shipped on Tuesday. Okay. Probably because tomorrow's a holiday. Right, right, right. <laughs> well, one thing I'm worried about, one thing I'm worried about, man, is is FedEx or UPS um, kind of know that these shipments are coming early. They yeah. put them in a holding facility, and they just be held at the facility until launch day. Right. Yeah. They, I mean... I don't. I mean, they could do it, and we're going to find that out, obviously, by Tuesday, because uh, I don't think anything's going to happen on Monday. I'm pretty sure FedEx and and UPS are closed on Monday. I might be wrong, but if if they're not closed, and if they are closed, then we're not going to find anything out until Tuesday. But I know some people have their phones in, in their town right now, in terms of like the UPS location. So, yep. I don't think. I mean, you're right. They could be held, and I think a lot of people would be disappointed. But I don't think that's yep. going to happen. I, I think this is a Samsung strategic way to get the phones out so it prevents any kind of return exchanges when that iPhone is launched. Yeah. They they want to get it out before the iPhone. The iPhone's going to be out, what was it, September 22nd, I think it was. That's the rumor right now. Yep. So, um, so they'll beat it. So, yeah, you're exactly right. So when it does come out, you know, usually carriers have like a 14-day return policy. Yeah. So if they get those phones in their hand, yeah, they're outside that 14 games. Yeah, that's a good point. That's a really good point, actually. Because you're right. Because they'll get it on the if, the if you guys get it on the. Because actually, doesn't the return policy start the day it ships? I know AT and T did some BS like the that return, with me. The return policy starts the day it's activated. Okay. Okay, that's fair enough then. So most people, I would probably guess, maybe 75 percent of the people, if they get it on the fifth. I would, they would either activate it the 5th or the 6th. And if you count 14 days out from there, that's the 20. But you know what? Even People could even see the iPhone. Um, it just They're going to see the iPhone before the 14-day policy because I, Apple's going to announce it on the 12th. So people still might return it. But, I mean, at that point, the iPhone's going to be very difficult to buy anyway. The iPhone. Well, here's, a, here's another thing, man. Here, here's another thing, too. I mean, you got your Android lovers and you got your iPhone lovers. Mm -hmm. I mean... People have been waiting for this phone. I mean, people still have the Note 7. I mean, I had the Note 7. I had to get rid of it. Yeah. I went to the Pixel. I'm very excited about this Note 8 coming out because I missed my Note 7. Uh -huh. um, I missed the I missed the gift feature. Um, the camera is going to be awesome on this phone. The wireless charging because you don't get it with the Google Pixel. Um, I kind of like the two the the 4G. Um, the 4G, uh, or not the 4G, the two gigs of sharing. You can share two gigs. Yep. Um, yeah, there's a lot of cool. Anything, there's messaging. a lot of. There's a lot of cool. Yeah. Yeah, there's, there's a, a lot, lot of features. features. Home, man. For sure. For sure. Um, and to go back to, um, you were talking to a, a person about like screen protectors or anything with the phone. Yep. I know there's a product out there. We sell it at our store. It's called Liquid Glass. Yep. yep. Um, that stuff is, if you haven't looked at it, look that up because liquid glass is going to probably be your best option for any kind of curved screen. Okay. Yeah, I've heard that before. A lot of people talk about that one for sure, yeah. Cool, man. Well, I appreciate the call. I have so many calls to go through. Uh, when you get your yeah, Note man. 8, definitely let us know and uh, send pictures and videos if you got it. And uh, Otherwise, definitely call in again. Yeah, absolutely. All man. right, man. Thanks for uh, reaching out, man. Yeah, no problem. Thanks for calling. Yeah. Well, you call me. I answer the phone. I, Keith, <laughs> I have to say it like that. I don't. What else am I going to say? Thank you for letting me call you. <laughs> got you, got you, got you. All right, man. That's All right, cool, later, man. man. I like it. Thanks, brother. I'll talk mean, to you soon. Bye. Bye. <laughs> you know what? We're going to do something crazy. The guy from the Netherlands got a phone number, and Daddy's going to call it. This guy's been working hard to get on this show. I appreciate that. I don't know his name. What's his name? Jason. I'm calling you, Jason. I don't know what else I can say. Jason. <laughs> Hello. How are you? Is this Greggles? Is yeah, it's Greggles. You're live on Greggles TV. Oh, thank you, sir. Thank you for calling. For allowing me to call in on, on your show, man. Thanks. I have so much good news for you from the netherlands we bring greetings we support you it's a small group but we're here thank you and so much just wanted to call in um just to update you what's going on yeah what's going on okay well according to our site from samsung 
um, the dates have been shifting. It's either the 13th or the 14th when you log into the website on Samsung. Okay. That's the delivery, the 13th or the 14th. It keeps fluctuating between those dates. And what was really interesting was that they're offering us a dual SIM, which have, yeah, we've never seen a dual SIM within Holland and certain parts of Europe before. So that's also an interesting offer. Do you, and does the, does, now, you get the dual SIM version, but do you get also, um, are you able to put an SD card in there? Yes. It, well, that's what they're saying. It's, uh, it's two SD cards, but um, if you use two SD cards, it's no SIM card, no uh, memory card. But you can use one S, um, one SIM card and one SD card. Okay, so you can use either two SIM cards or either one SIM and one SD. Yes. That's okay. Correct. That's awesome. And so what are you what are you gonna? Oh, you, let, I'll let you finish. I know you're talking. Talk some more. Go ahead. Oh, well, well, I'm gonna just order the normal, um, just the, the normal phone, uh, which allows me to use because all of the phones in Holland that's an interesting interesting thing. They're unlocked. Yep. So. We don't really have to worry about being locked down to one carrier. So we don't have to worry about that. So I just ordered the black. Hopefully, uh, it'll come early. I ordered it through um, T-Mobile because we have T-Mobile up here. Okay. <laughs> also, uh, <laughs> although our deals are uh, a lot different than um, the States, it's it's practically almost similar. Um, yeah, we How get the phone for free. And Wait, you guys get the phone for saying? free? Yeah, we get the phone for free. Like, if you buy it from a, off of a contract, we buy it for free. We get it for free. Wow. But then we would have to pay, um, along with our contract, we'd have to pay 32 euros a month. Oh, okay. It so, works. so it's similar yeah, it to what we... So, so you yeah, pay yeah, for your yeah. serv... So you, you, you're on contract, you, you get your service, but then you also have to pay an additional $32 a month for the phone. Yeah, that's just for the phone and not um, the contract. I think in total we're paying like 58 um, euros, and that's unlimited... Um, um, unlimited talk time, unlimited text, and we get 10 gigabytes of internet, and it's allowed to use throughout Europe, wow. and we get 6 gigabytes if we go over to the States. So that's, that's the plan good. that's being offered right now. That's pretty yeah. good. Yeah, in America, I don't. I guess you could get that so for Yeah, you could, there's no way in America. Yes, you could. Like, there's probably one carrier you could get something similar to that, but the, it's Sprint. And uh, it, it'd be tough to, I don't even know if they still, I, like I know somebody that has, what are they, which phone do they have? They have the iPhone 7, they have Sprint, and uh -huh. they have um, unlimited talk, unlimited text, and only three or four gig, four gigabytes of data, and they pay about $60 a month. So yeah. yours yeah. is still better yeah, for sure. About, yeah, because it's roughly about the same thing because what they're doing is, the same price that you guys are paying in um, the states for the Note 8, yeah. it's the same conversion they're using down here in Europe. So we're paying about 930, 920, but T-Mobile has that special deal. Like if you order it through them, yep. you're, you're paying like maybe like 890, 900 euros in that area. Is, 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 is yeah. T-Mobile a good carrier over in the Netherlands? Yes, right now they're rated the number one best network. Although they're not the biggest, right now they're rated um, the number one best okay. network. Oh, that's cool. What time is it over there? Gregor, I stayed up just for you. It's <laughs> about 3 a.m. in the morning. Oh, that's my God. Still I am just <laughs> to be talking to you. Oh, and we get, um, if, if we pre-order, we get um, the DAX for free. Yep, yep. That's, that's um, pre -order, our pre-order gift. We get the DAX. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, thank you so much. Uh, that's uh, I'm very impressed. Thank you so much. Um, well, no what? So just before before we get going, what 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 are you, what are you excited about the Note Eight for? Well, Gregor, you have to remember. Let me just bring you in news. I'm a tech junkie. We haven't had any form of a Note in two to three years, going in that two to three year range, because we missed out on the Note Five. Yep. Because so I'm still on my Note Four. I'm still on my Note Four. <laughs> so we missed out on the Note 5 because, according to Samsung, they didn't feel like certain Europeans were productive enough, so that never came to Holland. And then we waited for the Note 7, then we had that debacle, so now we are waiting for the Note 8. We are trying to, <laughs> I've been trying to talk to some of, of my friends and, you know, we're coming out strong so we can show Samsung that, you know, it's worth bringing it back here next year again. Yeah. So, yeah. That's awesome. What, what do most of your friends have for phones? Um, well, to be honest, um, Holland is a more iPhone-centric phone, mm -hmm. but I think ever since the S7 
and the S8. They have been making a sh slow shift to Samsung, but we have here more more iPhones because for some reason they get better deals, especially with the T-Mobile up here. For some reason they really push the iPhone phones. Like <laughs> the iPhone phones um, are coming out in a couple of weeks, and they already have up, you know, telling the customers that you can, you know, pre-order them shortly. Mm -hmm. The Note 8 is coming out just now, and they don't have any advertisements up for that. Only like something in a little corner, yeah, telling you that yeah, these are the new phones that are coming out, and I found that really hilarious. So yeah. but I guess it's something that they have between them and the iPhone. Uh huh. And it's yeah, interesting. Cool. That's, how it is up there. That's awesome, man. Uh, anything else you wanted to talk about or say? I'm just looking forward to, yeah, just having the Note 7 after two years. I mean, for I know a lot of people are complaining about the price. And they're complaining about the fact that, um, you know, that it's not really so much of an investment in terms of technology. But you have to remember there are those who, who never had the Note in the last two years. So for, for us, you know, that jump is such a big jump going from the Note 4 to the Note 8. So some of us are going to justify the price for that reason. And, you know, I just want to tell those guys who, who were lucky enough to get the Note 7 that, trust me, I hope you guys enjoyed it for the short time you had it. And because we never had a Note in two years. Just picture that. Yeah, that's awesome, man. I'm, I'm, I'm happy for you guys to be able to get that Note device that you guys seem to, a lot of you guys want, especially you and your friends probably. And uh, it's going to be a fun phone for sure. You're going to get your S Pen back and uh, all the cool software features that Samsung brings to to you guys, you guys get the Exynos version, right? Yes, we get we get the Exynos versions. I okay. guess that's the, the the good thing about yeah living in the Netherlands because we get the, the Exynos versions. But what? it's also a, a yeah. Go ahead. I was gonna say one final question. Do they? So you're gonna get it through T-Mobile over in the Netherlands, I believe you said. Um, yeah. Do, are you, do they end up putting their own apps on there? Like in America, when you buy no. the phone, they put a lot of crap on there. No, well, that that's the thing. In Holland, we have certain rules of what um, certain standards that the the phones have to be. You can't have bloatware or any sort sort of advertisements on your phone. What happens is when you insert your SIM card into the phone, it gives you a list of apps, right, in yep. your um, in your Google Store that goes along with your carrier that you can can download if you want to. So our phones are completely bloat free. That's awesome. Not connected. That's awesome. Yeah. Man. America, it's a different story. <laughs> you guys are definitely <laughs> lucky. So, yeah, man. Um, well, I appreciate the, 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 the let me call you and uh, being on the phone with you. It's a pleasure. I think you're the first person that's been on the show from outside of America or Canada. So, congratulations. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. I just I, I watch your show all the time. Yeah. So, yeah. Thanks so much. I, Which, to, I, I actually had to buy a number just to call in. Oh my god, Skype. man! You should. I'm sorry about that. That that's no that's no problem. I just prefer to give that on Patreon to you, but I guess that's not the case. So um, that's okay. At I'm sorry. You know, yeah, I'm gonna. Call I've been lazy about it. I'm. I, I keep meaning to add like Skype or something on. Um, I, I got to do something for sure. So I'll uh, I'll look. Oh, I'll definitely um, look into it. Um, my, my last bit of my last bit of information before I leave. Yeah. How I how I understood it because yeah I have my sources in T-Mobile from in Holland. Actually, they were um, Samsung was trying to do something where they released the phones in um that it looks like they're doing a worldwide delivery. In other words, that everywhere everybody all over the world gets their phones. But I guess it's it's slowly trickling out. So how I heard it was is that that first week of September was mainly dedicated to the United States. So hopefully, well, from what I heard, take it with a grain of salt, that for that first week, there will be people in the States saying that they got their phones. And that second week before the delivery of the 15th, there will be people in Europe and other places in the world also getting confirmations right, that right. they'll be delivered. And then on the 15th, we'll have, I guess, a more worldwide launch. Awesome. So I guess that's what I heard that we're going for. That's awesome, so that's man. That's so cool. I'm so I'm so happy for you guys. And again, I'm I'm very appreciative of everything. You staying up till three and you buying a phone number. It's crazy, man. It's like awesome. I, uh, uh, it, it's All very right. very appreciative of that. No problem. Anytime you need any information, anything you need to know, drop me an email. 
I'll let me. I'm here. Yeah, man. Definitely reach out to me too. It, I don't have a lot of uh, European information on those phones and the release dates and uh, and all that. I get a, I get little trickles of it, but I definitely, if you have that stuff, definitely send it over. Especially if you have. I, what would be cool if even if you see advertisements for the phones, different phones that are coming out, it, take pictures of it, send okay. it over. I'll definitely share it on my channel. I'll do that. I'll All right, I that. appreciate it so much, no man. Thanks for calling in. All right. All right, later, brother. Thanks. What a cool! Isn't that freaking cool, dude? Someone from the freaking Netherlands. All right, so we're getting towards the end of the show, guys. And I know a lot. I have so many people that want to be on the show. I'm so sorry. I would end up doing this show for freaking ever. Tamaria is definitely next. Tamaria just dropped. I don't have a word. I usually come up with names like $10. $10 donation is a dime. $12, I don't know what it is. Preteen. She gave me a preteen dis not discount. Preteen donation. Thank you so much. Tamaria, I'm calling you. You're next. Where are you at? Where you at, girl? I'll call you. 229. See what you're on your mind. So if you guys want to be in the show. I, I have to get going sooner or later, guys. You can do pay, uh, Please no, enjoy this Patreon. I'll, do, I'll call you. Also, oh okay, gosh, another dumb song. Tamaria, wait. Hi, wait, hi, Tamaria. One sec. Let me finish. Sorry. Okay. So, if you guys want to be on the show, do. Tamaria dropped a, a pre teen donation. You can do that, and I'll definitely call you. Uh, you can do Patreon, pick up a t shirt, whatever. I'll call you. But otherwise, guys, I have so many calls. I can't get to all of you, unfortunately. Tamaria, how are you? Thank you so much for that huge donation. Thank you. Yeah, no problem. But you're going to call me anyway. It doesn't matter whether <laughs> I donate or not. So, because it's me. <laughs> <coughs> I appreciate it so much. What is, what's, uh, what's, uh, what are you doing tonight? <laughs> Um, nothing really. I'm just excited about Tuesday. However, I'm not going to be too overly excited because I won't believe it until I see it. So until it happens. Basically. So your phone shipped, I think you told me, right? Because I know you texted me. Yeah. It's in uh, Memphis. I just checked while we were on the call because I saw um, one of the subscribers, Edgar, I think his name yeah. is. He said, like, um, his is already in his city. But uh, mine is still in Memphis, Tennessee, and I live in Georgia. Uh -huh. So, um... I'm still kind of up in the air. So I check like probably every two to three hours. <laughs> I'm a little anal over I know. So. But you're, so you're, uh, you got the, what'd you get, the black or the other gray? The orchid. And I went to Verizon to look at it, but the orchid gray isn't the same as like on my S8 Plus. It's different. It's like more pale, like more of a matte finish. So it's more grayer. I don't see the purple tones in it as much as I do on my S8 Plus. So I'm kind of okay. disappointed about that. Yeah, but you know what? You're going to – I know you were having some issues kind of to go back to the Galaxy S8 Plus I think you have. You were having issues with that. Are you still having issues with that phone or has it kind of died down? Yeah, it died down, but it recently just started a couple weeks ago where it, it's been doing random reboots again. <laughs> and I had to call tech support. So. Didn't you have that same issue with the phone before that too? Yeah, I mean, actually, I've been having problems from the get go, to be honest. Did but do you think? Don't you think it might be an app on your phone that's causing that? Well, you know, they had me. I've done like three factory resets though on it, and yeah. I the last time I downloaded each app one by one, and I downsized from three hundred plus apps to now only have one hundred and sixty. Wow, that's a big drop. Yeah. Yeah, it is, and it's still doing it. So. Dang. I don't know. <laughs> Dang, I'm dang, ready to be dang. done with it, though. Let's be honest. <laughs> yeah, I hear you. Are you gonna? So, <clears throat> if the if the Note does the same thing to you as the LG as the, as the last S8 Plus does, are you gonna switch to another phone? Are you gonna tough it up? What are you gonna do? Don't say that, Greg. Oh my gosh, do not put that <laughs> I'm so out pessimistic. in the universe. So to fruition. I'm so pessimistic. Well, well, well what are you gonna do? I mean, I'm trying to be optimistic. <laughs> yeah, but it's a good it's a good question. What are you gonna do if that phone? It's crops a great over question. You? Uh, I'm not sure. I mean, I'm loyal because I've had issues before with other uh, Samsung devices, and I stick with them. So yeah. uh, I have to really think about that one, Greg. Oh, dang it. <laughs> yeah, I, um, I, I'm with you. I, I think, I mean, I think, but I, you, you, the good thing is, is, though, if you do have issues with it, you can, well, you only have two weeks, but you could possibly return it <clears throat> if it's within those two weeks and just ride it out until a few other phones come out or even the next s phone so yeah because i actually i'm kind of feeling that iphone 8 slash iphone x i mean it looks You're pretty sweet to me <laughs> what the fuck 
No, you're gonna switch <laughs> to the bad team. Are you gonna be like uh, Liana? <laughs> Who knows, Greggles? Wow. I'm unpredictable. I'm a free spirit. Wow. I don't know if I like the new free spirit. <laughs> nah, I'm, I'm loyal, but I do like the way it looks, so. Yeah. It looks, I actually don't like the way it looks. It looks better than I thought it would look from, like, there's some more um, dummy units going out, and it doesn't look that as bad as I thought it did. Uh, but I still don't like the placement of the camera. I think that looks ugly. Um, the copper, the copper color or whatever they call it. Is really ugly. Um, really, I kind of like the copper. Uh, it's not really copper. It still looks rose to me, but I mean, I like it. No, that thing's it's pretty ugly. Sweet. It's kind of more feminine. Cause I'm sorry, the feminine gray and black are just so freaking boring. Um, I mean, dang it, Samsung. Copper, <laughs> copper. Yeah, yeah. Do you copper. like? Do you like rose gold? Yeah, I do. You do like rose gold. <laughs> yeah, I I do. I mean. I don't necessarily buy it in jewelry, but I like the way it looks. So yeah. I would buy it as a phone because it's a history, <laughs> but You're crazy. I mean, I really wanted the deep sea blue, though, to be honest. That blue so. looks dope. Actually, have you seen the blue on the... <laughs> it sounds like I'm getting paid by LG. Have you seen the blue on the LG V30? <laughs> <laughs> no, I haven't. But I do like the LG V30, too. Like I said on the chat, it's a solid device. So yeah. I have no gripes. And I've had LG before in the past. I think yeah. I had a G3 once in red. Mm -hmm. So yeah, they, they. But I don't think they're releasing the blue here either. America gets screwed over with the colors. We get we get the the, the junk, not the junk colors, but just like know, the basic right? plain colors. Exactly, definitely the basics. And That's what I mean, you know what I don't I need understand. Them to liven up. You know what I don't understand is the iPhone. Sorry to cut you off. Is the iPhone? They say they have colors, and they, you, they have every single color here in America. They don't mess around. It's not like the Note. They're like, oh, we have these four colors, but we're only releasing two in America. It's not like that, which exactly. kind of sucks. But I think if they did release all four colors, because I know it costs them money, and most people won't buy some of the colors, They should. what they should do is on their, on their own website, they should offer it on a first-come, first basis in terms of like, hey, you, you can't buy it at the store, but if you want these colors, you can buy it through us directly. Yeah, that's a good idea, Greggles. I think yeah. you probably should talk to somebody at Samsung about that. <laughs> oh, I'll talk to Seriously. my I'll talk to my non contact <laughs> that I have at Samsung. <laughs> I'm for real though. Seriously, you really should. I, I mean, know. That's a great idea. If they ever asked me, I would tell them, but they probably wouldn't give two flying. Because then I probably would buy directly from Samsung versus you know my carrier. Yeah. Well, they. That's I'm I'm really happy about Samsung offering the unlocked version. Uh, they do you can get it through Best Buy and them and them directly. I I love that they're doing that. I think that's awesome. Okay, yeah, so, that is pretty cool. Yeah, that and way. I consider that when we text, you mentioned it. I didn't cut you off either, but um, I thought about it and then I changed my mind. So, oh, book well, anything? Well, you have to, the thing is you have to pay it. All. I think you pay a, if I remember correctly. I think you buy you buy your phones all up. At once, or do you? Yeah, pay the plan? I get them all at. Yeah, I pay for it all at once. At uh, once, yeah. So, I mean, if I were you, I don't know why you didn't get the unlocked version. Why didn't you get the unlocked version at that point? You should have. Um, because when I did it, I was getting a better deal through my carrier versus them. So, okay, that's why. <laughs> got it. Got it. Tamara, you got anything else? No, I think that's pretty much it. But I'm thinking you talk to other people longer than me, and I feel cheated. Who would I call? And I'm loyal. I called no, other people. No, I you talked to other people. No, you talked to other people longer than me. What do you like mean? The guy wait, 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 that wait, works wait. at that's employed at Verizon, and the guy that went to Las Vegas. Wait, wait. I mean, wait, that wait. was just yeah. Oh, you're right. You've only been. I'm going to give you another three minutes. <laughs> Thank you very much. So, I really appreciate that. What else do you want to talk about? <laughs> Go ahead. Bring up the topics. You're you're the host. I know, right? Um. <clears throat> Okay, the like pressure's I said, on. I did go to the Verizon store to check it out, and I was really, like, amazed. Um, when I compared my S8 Plus to um, the Note 8 yep. in the store, the Note 8 actually looked clearer than my S8. I mean, <clears throat> so you, I was actually really blown away. I've actually heard that. I've actually heard uh, some of the people that have, have compared the two phones have said that the, the Note 8 screen is better. I've also heard... That the LG V30. <laughs> Here's my sponsorship with <laughs> LG. I have to say this: <laughs> that I the see. LG V30 actually the screen looks better and brighter on the LG V30 than on the on the S8 Plus. Yeah, I've seen that on some of the two. Well, the videos here on YouTube, but yeah. 
of course, I haven't witnessed that in person yet. Exactly. To concur. <laughs> right. I hear you. Um, yeah, but uh, so you, I know you want a case for me. You've been to keep you bug me every day, but not every day. You bug yeah, me every day. my what defender is, so, in the till blue. <laughs> the Autobox defender in till blue. Yeah. <laughs> what 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 other Please case? Send. Are you gonna get a case? Because I obviously I can't send you a case obviously until I review it. But what are you? Are, is there a case you're gonna get in the meantime, or or what are you gonna do? Yeah, I did um, already order one from Amazon. I got a vegan. Or somebody said Spigen. Is it Spigen or Spigen? Which one is it? I think it? it's Spigen. I don't even know. Okay. Those mother effers, <laughs> dude, are friggin' annoying because, like, most companies, I can just email them and say, hey, send me a case and they'll do it. This one, you have to go through this website and you can only choose one case. And, you ha- and like, uh, most of the cases you can choose from are not the phones you want. It's like last generation's phones. I'm like, I don't want that or I don't have that phone. So it, it's such yeah. a pain in my ass. I hate, I don't hate those guys, but I hate those guys. Yeah, I get you. I understand. It's like a catch twenty two. Yeah. Damned if you do, damned if you don't. Basically. Exactly. It's annoying. Yeah, very much so. I what, would imagine, Greggle. What else you got for me? Ah, <laughs> uh, that's pretty much it. I guess I won't be selfish because oh, can you please call this big son um three three six? Because I'm so tired of him on the chat. Like, <laughs> please call, please. I don't call, think he's call. texting me anymore. He's not messaging anymore. And I told him to text you. I don't. I guess he doesn't realize it. So. Yeah, I don't see it. I did see it earlier, but yeah, it's. I've been on the show for an hour and thirty minutes. That's really long for me. <laughs> yeah, it, it is, Bregos. But there's um, a lot of people in I've here still. I've enjoyed the show. You're always amazing. No, I, I hear that all the time, and it never gets old. <laughs> all right. Well, peace, Bregos. All right. Cool. Oh, well, I appreciate it. Thanks. Yeah, you're bye, welcome. Bye. 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 All right, guys, I think we're going to wrap the show up. Uh, so thank you so much for hanging out, guys. It was fun chatting with you all. I'm sorry I couldn't get to all of you. I appreciate the support for the show. Um, if you want to subscribe and you're not subscribed, make sure you subscribe. Uh, new videos every single day, sometimes two to three. And I uh, keep you guys up to date with that stuff. So thank you so much. Uh, if you want to support the show, Patreon is down below, as is the T-shirt link. If you want to pick up a t-shirt that helps me out immensely as well and uh, if you do get a t-shirt send me a picture of you holding out that t-shirt otherwise when you get your galaxy uh, node 8 uh, send me some pictures of it send me a video not I don't want a seven minute video but uh, maybe a few seconds let me know what you think about the phone or maybe something cool to show off on the phone and that's pretty much it guys so thanks so much sorry I'm really really sorry I couldn't call you on I literally had god maybe like 50 calls I had to do 60 calls and I just can't do it guys so thanks so much And I'll see you down the road. Peace.